So, after you do the update in your, uh, after you do the radio update in your Kia K5, right, you will get full screen Android Auto, so no more of that half of it being chopped off. Now, you, you, you can put it like this, uh, have your music right there. Or you can actually go actual full screen Android Auto. You know what I'm saying? So you can close this. I forgot how to close it, but you can actually close this and then I, I, I'm just referring to it as this. I don't know why. But yeah. You have full screen with your Android Auto. Now, some of y'all been having problems doing the update. So what I'm going to do now is I'm actually going to go in the house, cut the computer on, and show you why. Well, I, you'll plug in your USB, and it will say, um, you plug in your USB, and it says, uh, insert, the, insert the USB with the actual update files on it, even though you got the files on the USB. I actually... I have the fix for that, so I'm actually going to show that to y'all uh, when I go in the house in a second. And I'm going to do that right now, so I'm going to go ahead and hit pause on this video and show y'all what to do. Alright, so like I said, if you're running into that problem, what you do is, when you use the, when you use the, uh, the Kia website to get the update, it's going to put it in the folder, right? 2022 K5 USA, right? And that is on my USB drive, right? What you want to do is you want to click on it and you want to take all the files. Take all the files, take them out of that K5 folder and just put it directly on the drive, right? So now when you go to the, to the USB drive, Right, take them just like that and move them directly to the drive itself. So now, right, then you could get rid of this, uh, this one right here. You can actually get rid of that. You don't need that. All you need is the files like that directly on the drive. And that'll stop uh, the, the issue when it says, um, please insert drive with the right files on it. That's how you... Uh, remedy that problem so and it takes about an hour i don't know why they say 25 minutes it actually takes about an hour and 10 minutes to do but that's how i went ahead and fixed the update uh problems i was having trying to update my radio and my navigation and all that hope this video helps out i'm out peace